In the topic series, we're talking about all different types of face shields and brackets that we make for industrial applications. Right now, we're going to talk about metallized windows. Metallized windows are specifically made to reflect the heat that comes off of the furnace. These metallized windows are based of, uh, on a polycarbonate based material and then they've been put into a vacuum chamber where 24 karat gold has been vacuum deposited onto the surface. There is an additional hard coating that's put over the gold to protect it so that the shield does not so scratch so easily. They still need to be handled with great care. The metallized windows are not intended for abrasion purposes but they are intended specifically to reflect heat away from the worker. I can, tell from, I can say from my own experience, if you wear one of these metallized windows and you're facing a molten pool of 4130 steel at close distance, the heat will not come through this window and you'll be cool behind it. So starting off, this is the IM12 GHC6FM. What that stands for is it's injection molded shield number 12, which is a six inches top to bottom, 15 and a half inches right to left. It has a 060 thickness. The GHC stands for gold hard coated. The six is 060. The F, it means that it's permanently formed. And M is a designation of a medium green base. If I turn this over, you'll see that it is a green color on the inside. So this green color in combination with the gold gives it a particular look for the uh, worker so he's able to identify certain characteristics in the molten steel or molten glass. This particular model is designed to fit on with a uh, chin protector. I'm showing it here with a, a chin protector a-CP. Now you've got a splash protection from underneath. The chin protector is uh, high temperature material nylon. You have your gold reflective layer and then this can be worn onto uh, any one of the brackets that are designed for high temperature. I'm just illustrating it here with one of our aluminum brackets. We also have high temperature plastic brackets that are uh, actually will exceed the temperature of the helmets. This is an IM13 GHC 8FM. So this model is injection molded shield number 13. GHC stands for gold hard coated. The 8 stands for the thickness, so this is a thicker shield than the previous one. F is it's formed and medium green in color. This is also designed to work with the chin protector. And this model is uh, specifically made for use in the aluminum smelting industry. It holds up well to the heat. The aluminum splash, if it does, is splashed, uh, will uh, shed off of the shield and the, uh, the color is also adjusted for use in aluminum uh, foundry work. Our next model, I have it sitting on an HG7 headgear for demonstration purposes. So the, this is the IM20 GHC6F. So it's injection molded shield number 20, IM20, GHC gold hard coated, 060, so that's what the, the 6 stands for, and F meaning that it's formed. And this is on a clear base, so as far as a metallized shield to reflect intense radiant heat away, this is the clearest model that you can have because it doesn't have a medium green base. In some applications, uh, they have a, a lack of lighting and so, um, and in many steel mills, if you've been to a steel mill, you'll notice like sand floors, poor lighting, but yet some very bright areas. And so the, the clear color of the base material with the gold over the top gives them the heat reflective capacity, but still you're able to see very well in your application. You'll notice that on the shield, 
The uh, cutaway area right here fits exactly into this corner, and this HG7 comes way back to protect your head from the heat and sparks. The next model in our lineup is an IM20 GHC6FM. So this is the same size shield as what I just showed you. The only difference is that it has a medium green base. And the medium green base is to adjust that color so that the worker is able to see in his particular surroundings and then also look at his work and it appear the correct way. Now we're moving to an IM20 XGH C 6FD. It's a long nomenclature, but the designation it indicates that there's an extra amount of gold on this shield for in, uh, even more heat reflection than previously. It's on a dark green base. This is for the worst of conditions or the highest heat of conditions, uh, such as uh, titanium smelting. Titanium is the highest refractory metal uh, for temperature and this shield is designed just for that type of an application. We're now showing an IM22 GHC 6F. So the IM22 series includes this extra protection area back here which when you use that onto a cap bracket provides a very good fit and protection all the way back by your ears. The IM22 GHC 6F, 10 inches top to bottom, 20 inches right to left, 060 thick, has the molded in bead all along this edge, and it's on a clear base. The clear base allows the best possible vision, yet still giving you that high heat reflective value. Next model is an IM22 GHC. 6FM. So this has a, the advantage of the, the good protection on the side. It has a medium green base, gold on the front for heat reflection, hard coating over the gold, 060 thick, molded in bead, universal hole pattern, 10 inches top to bottom and 20 inches right to left. Our next model is the IM22 XGHC 6FD. This is another one of the models that's specifically for titanium smelting. It has extra amount of gold for heat reflection, it has a dark green base, molded in edge, universal hole pattern, and it has this nice end that comes back to give you the good side protection to the visor. Now we're entering with, into our gradient tint visors. This is an S42 GHC 6F. GRAD2. The 2 stands for a 2 inch space of a dark green color in the top. The rest of the window is clear. All of this is overcoated with gold. Obviously this is a very specialized shield, but the advantage of it is that as the person wears it, they can look through this narrow top section here, which is uh, dark green, looking into the furnace or looking into the, um, the kiln, and then as they're walking or moving, they can see through much easier through this gold coated section that has a clear base on the bottom. 10 inches by 20 inches, universal hole pattern, and has the cutout so it can be used on the cap brackets or it can be used on the HG7 headgear or an HG4. Another long model number here, an S42, GHC 6F GRAD 4. The 4 stands for a 4 inch gradient tint color. So it's dark green on the top, clear in this lower section below, universal hole pattern across the top, gold coated with a hard coating over the top of the gold. These shields are very specific for steel mill use and the, uh, the workers find that they are more productive when they wear these. Not only do they stay cooler behind them, but they have this optimized vision circumstance with these 
gradient tints and their clear areas so they can see their feet. Our last model in this series is the IM14 GHC12F. This only fits into a heat treating uh, helmet. There is no hole pattern. It will not fit onto our cap or hat brackets or our headgear. It is gold coated, hard coated over the gold. It's injection molded the shape. It does not have the bead along its edge because the bead uh, is not necessary because it fits into a complete aluminum frame. This shield um, is a, a, a standard in the, uh, in the heat treat and in the hot metal industry. And uh, the workers will find that the optics are excellent. The heat rejection values uh, will keep them cooler on the inside than, uh, than a clear shield. And they'll be uh, much more productive throughout the day.